Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. If you guys are new here, my name is Anna Jolene and I'm the author of the Glory MC series, the Moonrise Beach series, and the Heartbreaker series. So I'm going to be doing my memory spread for this week. I am going to be using a kit from my shop. It is called Indie Floral and I'm going to be using the full kit here. So that is all six pages. Let me quickly show you what the kit looks like. So it has these a beautiful burgundy and kind of like warm orangey florals, which are my faves, especially for this time of year. So I thought that I would pull this beautiful kit for this week. So I'm really excited about using this collection. I do have the matching deco here and I will be uh, integrating some of those with my spread and then I also have the small monthly scripts. So this is how last week turned out. It kind of has a similar vibe to the kit that I'm going to be using this week so that's why I wanted to use it. Um, but this was last week, it was my birthday week and this kit is called Fanula Floral. So I do have a plan with me on my channel if you guys are interested in it. And these inserts that I'm using are from my shop. They are printables. So if you guys are interested in the sticker kit or the printables from my shop, you guys can use the code SAVE10 to save 10% off of your order. All right, so let's get started with putting down the base first. So I'm gonna start with this side here with the bottom washi. Now I absolutely love the format of this kit because you get so many stickers and you can use them in a lot of different planners as well. So I know a lot of you guys use these sticker kits in um, all of your ring bound planners, the Erin Condren as well, and other planners like the Hobonichi. So um, if you are using the stickers in your planners or journals, uh, do tag me on Instagram or wherever you like to post. If you film videos, I would love to see them so I can see how you're all using it. But this week, um, I finally was able to edit my vlog. Um, I've been collecting footage since August actually. I know that seems kind of crazy but um, I did film a vlog as I worked on the collab vent box but because the box does not release until uh, early December um, I have not been able to share that vlog yet. So this week I was finally able to edit all the footage and I'm really happy with how it turned out since it was my first vlog. So I think I'm going to probably film some more and um, obviously I will post that collab band once we are able to share uh, because obviously it's an advent calendar and we want the box to be a surprise for everyone so I can't share. Uh, what's inside just yet it has to be a secret but since I enjoyed making that vlog I'm probably gonna make some more uh, in the meantime and we'll see if I post it before or after that one but yeah I have been enjoying uh, the vlogs so um, let me know if there is something else that you guys would like me to vlog um, I did some behind the scenes of the shop and things like that. But I can also just share a little bit more of my personal life. Um, I can also share a little bit of the behind the scenes for um, my book that's coming out. Um, I have one that's coming out in a couple of weeks in November. So I can also share what I like to do to prep for a book release because my book's going to the editor in a couple of days. So I've been working on that. So if that is something that you're interested in, just let me know and I can definitely share a little bit more of how I like to do things around here. So I'm just adding some of those uh, foiled headers. They have like a simple bow from Simply Gilded on the top there and I think that's really sweet. So I'm just gonna scatter my boxes. I like to stagger them. And I'm also using the headers 
uh, just the brown ones here uh, from the kit to add a little bit of something more to the spread. And I think I'll be using all of the boxes that I have here as um, I haven't completed my reading for this week, so yeah. So this week I did have a couple of tote bag deliveries and I have some exciting news to share with you guys. I'm gonna be having our canvas tote bags available in a larger size now. So if you love our canvas tote bags, I know many of you guys have already purchased it, uh, but have always wanted like a larger size. Well, I have them now in larger sizes. So we are gonna be having a new release uh, for those tote bags very soon. So if you are one of those people who requested uh, to have them made larger, that's exactly what I've done. So we're gonna have them in the same colors that we already have in the shop. Um, they're just gonna be the extra large size now so that's going to be really exciting um, they arrived this week so i'm just going to make sure that um, everything is okay with them do a quick quality check and then we'll get them all listed up in the shop so you guys can uh, purchase them i'm really really excited about them because like i said a lot of you guys have been asking for it so i'm really happy that i was actually able to do it um, Meanwhile, we do have the corduroy tote bags in the shop. Those pair pretty nicely with the corduroy pouches, which are also really popular in the shop. We have a few different bag options now and different sizes, so that is always really cool. So I'm just gonna grab these fancy boxes that we have in the kit. I will be putting one up here and another one here. And as for the floral piece, um, I like to have like a bigger floral, so we'll add one here and then maybe this one here. By the way, these tweezers um, and the scissors that I'm going to be using to cut the uh, stickers with are all from my shop. And then we'll grab the October script. We're almost done with October. It seems like it went by really fast. Okay. So there we go. That is what the base is looking like so far, I think. I'm pretty happy with that. Now let's zoom in and we'll start to fill in everything. The sun is coming out, so I'm really happy about that. Um, I feel like um, it's been kind of cold these past few days, so I'm hoping that the weather will get warmer because it's too cold right now. So this week, um, we did have a new special release. I released the new uh, monthly deco kit. So this is like an add-on. It's three extra pages for our decorative kits. And basically it is a universal monthly. So you can use it in any of the Hobonichi sizes. Uh, you can use them in any size planner basically it's a universal kit so i've been using it in my hobinichi weeks and i absolutely love it so um, that is now available as an add-on for a decorative kit or you can just use that as an extra um, decorative element to your spreads if you don't want to use them as a monthly but i decided to add that to the shop as it was something that was requested so this week I did some designing for some new spring items. We have spring sunshine and spring awakening that I'm working on. And then, like I said, I did uh, work on that vlog and getting that done. So let me just mark that here in my list. And then I'm just gonna add another floral here. Okay, so that's the sidebar done. So for Monday, I did not have an event for this day, but I am going to mark in my design time. So both of these stickers are from my shop. Um, and then I also did take a nap. I have this sticker from Mr. and Mrs. Mint. I know she recently changed her shop name, but um, I don't know what the new one is called. I think it's like Coffee Bean Studio. It could be something similar to that. 
Um, I will have to go and check that out because yeah, she recently just changed it, I think yesterday. So um, I have to get used to her new name. But that is from her shop. Um, I did also watch my uh, TV show. So I'm gonna mark that in. And I just also cut up some of the florals so that I can use it. So I have these dumbbell stickers. Those are from my shop. And then for this one, we are marking in the tote bag delivery. So uh, I have these stickers from Teddy's Plans Co. to mark in the deliveries that we had to this week. So there we go. So that's everything um, in terms of my events. I did also have a new release. So I wanna mark that in too. Let's add the floral. So for my new release, I'm gonna use this sticker from Hello Petite Paper and I'm also just marking in laundry with a Paper Bits Co character. So this week's new release was Joy to the World. It's another Christmas collection. So there we go. Okay, so Tuesday at no events, I did do some printing and cutting. These stickers are from Paper Shire. Um, they have like a fall theme to them, so I thought that they would be perfect for this time of year. So I'm just adding that there. This print and cut sticker is from my shop. I'm also gonna mark in film and editing up in this section right here. So let me grab a couple of different boxes. So for filming, I'm just gonna use this boba sticker from Paper Echoes and then for editing, I'm gonna use this sticker from, I think it's Paper Crown Planner. That edit script is from my shop. All right, so let's jump to the bottom here and mark in my workout. Um, I didn't work out every single day this week like I did last week, but I got a good amount of workouts in, so that's not too bad. These dumbbells are from my shop and this workout script is also from my shop. Um, I did get some Happy Mail this day. I did get um, some Armani foundation. The Luminous Silk one is my all-time favorite. So I'm just gonna add that here. Let me also add some of the florals. Oops. For makeup, I'm gonna use another Happy Mail sticker from Teddy's Plans Co. The Sephora sale is coming up too, so I'm probably gonna buy some more makeup. And then at the bottom here, I'm just gonna mark in that I uploaded my 2025 Hobonichi Week setup already. So if you're interested in checking that out, uh, it's up on my channel. Every week I'm gonna be sharing my setup for 2025. So we started with the weeks, which is always really fun. On to Wednesday, I did have an event. I had to renew some of my books. So let's put that down. I'm gonna use these stickers. These are really cute and cozy looking. Those are from Ohana Story. I thought that I would pull out all of my fall themed stickers. Uh, anything that's kind of like cozy and warm colored, I pulled in for this spread. Okay, so let's mark in editing. I'm gonna use these coffee cups and this edit script from my shop again. Um, let's mark in the TV show that I watched and I'm gonna pull in another floral, I think. So um, it's a cooking show, so I'm gonna add this little um, sticker from my little puffy there. Um, and then I also was able to do some yin yoga. I've been trying to do more yoga at the end of the day just to help me wind down. So that's been helpful. This sticker is from my shop as is the script. And then this day we also had another tote bag delivery. So I'm gonna mark that here at the bottom. And I do have this floral here that I want to use just on top there. So we'll use another Happy Mail sticker from Teddy's Plants Co. 
All right, so that is the first half of the week done. Now let's move on to the second half. So Thursday at no events. Let's jump in with um, designing. So I'm using a sticker from Paper Shire once again. And this design script is from my shop. I also had to film. So let's mark that in next. And I'm going to use another sticker from Paper Shire to do so. I did have some family come over. It was my birthday last week, but they weren't able to make it on the actual day. And so they ended up coming on this day to celebrate. So I got some presents and things like that. I'm just going to mark that in here with a family time sticker. This is a custom sticker from my shop and the script is also from my shop. So after that visit, I did do a nice workout. So let me mark that in again. And I'm using the same dumbbells from my shop as is this script. And then um, I did upload a unboxing video. So I did get a standard wide, so that's personal wide planner from VDS. So I'm going to use this ring bound planner girl. That's a custom again from Teddy's Plans Co. This is my second parm that I got. I have now in the personal wide and the personal size. So there we have it. That's everything for Thursday. Loving how that looks so far. All right. Um, at the top here, Let's mark in that I did some editing. I edited that vlog, which actually took me quite a long time as it was my first time editing a vlog. I didn't know what I was doing. So I'm just gonna use a paper shire sticker for that. This script is from my shop once again. Um, and then I did get some happy mail from Hollister. I ordered some jeans. So that arrived and I'm going to use this stack of sweaters to help me mark that in. All right, so below that, I'm going to mark in my journaling time. Again, using another sticker from Paper Shire. The script is again from my shop. At the bottom here, I want to mark in the release that we had in the shop. And I'm just going to add a few boxes here and some of the florals. All right, so for the release, I think I'm just going to use this coffee cup sticker. We'll add that here uh, for the monthly deco kit release. I'm going to use this sticker from the Coffee Monsters Co. to mark in that it was so cold this day, the temperature dropped. So I just want to mark that in. And then lastly, I'm going to use this sticker here to mark in that my headaches finally stopped this day. Okay, on to Saturday now. I am first gonna go in with a box to mark in that um, I did film. So for filming, we're gonna use another one of these stickers from Paper Shire. I also did a lot of cleaning this day. I decluttered and also organized my desk and things like that. So let's use another sticker for that. This cleaning girl is from Paper Bits Co. I am gonna mark in journaling again. I've been loving my journal, so we're gonna use this sticker again from Paper Shire. And then I will mark in my workout once again. So I have the same dumbbells and the script from my shop. And then at the bottom here, I'm gonna mark in, I went to bed early. So I'm gonna use these sleeping masks. This is from My Little Puppy. I haven't been sleeping well this week, so I wanted to make sure that I got caught up on my sleep. So on Sunday, I did have an event. I'm gonna go in with this darker color. I really like this color. And we'll mark in my renewal that I had to do early in the morning. So we'll use that sticker again. And then 
Um, I'm gonna mark in that I edited my YouTube video. So we'll use another sticker from Paper Echoes to mark that in. And this script is from my shop. Going in with a scallop box. I'm gonna mark in that I did some reading. So I'm actually just going to center that because it says reading on there. That's from Paper Echoes once again. And I'm gonna mark in also my workout once more. So you guys know already by now I'm using the same combo from my shop. And then lastly here, I do have my plan with me video going up. So we'll use this Paper Shire sticker again. This script is from my shop. So that is everything. I'm gonna pop this back in my planner now and we can see the finished look. So here is the spread back in my planner. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Once again, if you guys are interested in the Indie Floral Collection, it's now available in my shop. Feel free to use the code SAVE10 to save 10% off of your order. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you guys have any requests for any future stickers or new releases, do leave them down below. Thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye guys.